So why get cycling shoes at all? Actually, if you get a clipless pedal and a cycling shoe that clips into it, it makes you about 40% more efficient on your bike, just for starters. And then once you get the hang of your fluid pedal motion and everything, it's going to make you so much faster, so much stronger, and it's actually going to be easier to ride. All right, now what kind of shoe should you get? There are two basic diff types of shoe. There's a mountain bike shoe and a road bike shoe. The two shoes typically parallel each other as they go up and get into higher quality. Your main difference is going to be in the sole. A mountain bike shoe has tread on the bottom so that you can walk, so you can get off your bike, run up a hill, however, it takes a slightly different cleat than a road bike shoe, which is slick on the bottom, considerably harder to walk in, but it's a little, little easier to ride over long distances. On your basic shoe, you're going to get a plastic sole and something like this with some Velcro straps, maybe even a lace-up type closure. It has lots of vents in it, but as you get nicer, you get more and more ventilation. Also, as you get nicer, you get a much stiffer sole. At first glance, when you try these on, they may seem uncomfortable. A very stiff sole, unlike a tennis shoe, does not flex when you walk. However, when you're on the bike, that's exactly what you want. The more rigid that sole stays, the more it does not flex, it's the more of your power transfer that goes directly to the bike. So the nicer your shoe, the more uncomfortable to walk, but the, more, the stronger it makes you on the bike which is why a high-end shoe like this actually has a carbon fiber sole. We have a lot of different shoes at Higher Gear, ranging from road biking shoes to mountain biking shoes. We even have triathlon specific shoes that are easy to get on and off in a transition. Whatever your riding style may be, come on into Higher Gear and we'll find you a shoe that fits you just right.